Hey everybody, this is Jordan from PictureMonk.com and welcome to another Friday freebie. This one's kind of a cool one here. Uh, this one has to do with custom Photoshop brushes uh, that sort of mimic clouds, which is giving you a lot of flexibility in adding a little bit more interest to your photos. So in order to download these cloud brushes, head on over to PictureMonk.com, search the Friday freebie section, and you'll find them there, or just click the link in the description below. It'll take you right to the link to download them. So once you get the uh, downloaded file to your computer uh, to load the brushes, you just click on the uh, brush over here and uh, click the menu for the brushes up here. Click the gear icon and choose load brushes. So go to where you downloaded your file at and you're looking for the ABR file. And so I just put mine on the desktop. I click right here and click open. And at the bottom of your menu, it'll add the clouds down here. So what we're going to do is just going to uh, select one of these clouds uh, images here. We'll just pick one at random. And we're going to create a new layer so that way we don't mess this layer up. And now we're just going to um, go ahead and enlarge this brush and click and make a cloud. So as you can see, this white, pure white cloud does not match the, uh, the, the kind of bluish tint to the image here not a big deal this cloud will work great on uh, you know wide open sky daytime images it will work perfect there however we want to match the color of the clouds in here so the easiest way to do that is just to hold the option key and you'll get an eyedropper here and it'll sample the color in one of these clouds now when we click we get that so now let's go ahead and find another cloud image we can use we'll do this one make it a pretty large one right around there there we go and that one actually worked really well because it kinda looks like it came off of this cloud the existing cloud and went right up in the sky so now we're gonna get let's just do a few more to see how they turn out so we'll just keep adding some clouds and let's do another one this will be the last one and we'll just choose this one and we'll put it right over the top of the peak of the mountain here so right there so this was the original image and this was the new one with the with the custom cloud brushes now the only thing i'm going to do extra to make it match the scene is if i scroll in a little bit here zoom in you can see there's color noise in the uh in the existing image so i'm just going to add a little bit of noise to the photo so i'm going to go to uh, filter noise add noise uh this one uh, value looks a little a little good there matches it all right so now we have noise to uh, to kind of match the scene so again here is the original and here is the uh, the edited one with the custom clouds so as you can see there's a lot of uh, a lot of different clouds in here in the brushes uh, and a lot of different varieties that you can add in there and it's just it gives you endless possibilities of what you can use these for so I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that Friday freebie again head on over to picturemonk.com and search the Friday freebie section to download the custom brushes or just go click the link in the description below and it'll take you right to there. Thanks again guys for joining me and I'll see you guys in the next video.